hey guys thank you for joining me and welcome back to my channel i am latoya hart and i am your heartbreak and happiness expert tonight we are going to talk about turning heartbreak into success i get it like when you're experiencing heartbreak the last thing you're thinking about is how this pain how this experience can be turned into something truly amazing and i want you to know that it is totally possible heartbreak is the last thing that we are thinking about at the beginning of a relationship a career or whatever it is that we um truly feel amazing about truly feel fulfilled with and truly feel like it is going to last it is going to go the long haul and it's something that is going to be you know pretty permanent right we start to settle in that relationship and we get comfortable we start to make plans to be with this person and you know relationships have ups and downs but we ultimately know or think or believe that at some point things will get better but in certain situations, they don't get better. And the relationship comes to an end, whether it's something that you expect or something that is totally unexpected, it is never comforting to um, deal with heartbreak. But the truth is this, even though we go into relationships with the um, expectation that it will continue and we don't really expect it to end, all love won't last forever. All relationships won't last forever. There, there's no way that we can um, predict when a relationship will end. But when it does, it hurts and affects all of us equally the same. So what can you do? Like, how can you approach um, dealing with a, a, a heartbreak? Like, how can you approach dealing with the end of a relationship? It's simple, but not simple. It is really sitting down, evaluating things, and thinking about um, the things that are within your control and the one thing that is totally within your control is managing the ability to um, manage your emotions not to deny them or not to not acknowledge them but to as they come up to manage your emotions and the ability to decide what you want in the future you cannot control the actions of others you cannot control um, someone else's decision to not be in a relationship with you but you can control how you respond to their decision you can control how you um, work on you and healing so that you can become a better person and you can become whole so that you can be a great partner in future relationships right now is totally about working on you healing the broken parts of you and truly understanding how can you learn and how can you grow from this experience there will be pressures on you from friends and family members to let it go overnight and to just forget about it but when a relationship ends you cannot just dump your emotions you cannot just slam on the brakes instantly it takes some time to go from being in this place where you have um these feelings and you have someone to express your feelings to to having these feelings and not having a place to or direction to send them in right so it takes some time to kind of dial things back and then kind of figure out you know where to go and there isn't a timeline that you have to put on it a couple weeks couple days couple months there's, that's not necessary you can't put a time on a, a timeline on how long it will take you to heal but the most important thing is that you get better every day that you make progress every week that you are feeling better from one week one day one month to the next and as long as you are heading in the right direction then you do not have to rush to say okay i'm going to be better within three months take your time go go through it and grow through it become the best version of yourself and ultimately you will emerge a much better person and much better prepared for your next relationship i am latoya hart if you have any questions um, post them in the comments below i love to chat with you and i'll catch you in my next video